Today we will solve a problem called boats to save people. So here we have a number of people. Each people, each person has uh, different weights, and we have a number of boats. So uh, we have to safely uh, move all the people from one side of the river to other. So let's take an example. So there are some conditions. So one condition is that maximum two people are allowed in a boat. So this is one condition. and the boat has a limit you cannot put heavier people than the limit in the boat and it's also given that uh, all the boats will have some limit and uh, let's take a boat which has a limit l then none of the persons will have weight more than l so the heaviest person will be less than or equal to the boat limit so all the boats have a limit so you got the idea max two people if let's say a uh, boat has a limit of 5 all the boats have a limit of 5 and there is a person with a weight of 5 then you cannot uh, put two people here although you can uh, there is a space for two people but the weight limit is exhausted by this single person itself or let's say there are people of weights 4 and 2 and the limit is 5 still if you put these two we will get a total of 6 which will be more than the limit so these are the conditions and of course uh, in this problem we want to find the minimum number of boats required maximum number would be put one person in a single boat all the people in separate boats so let's see how we can solve this problem so first we will look at the heaviest person or the lightest person uh, any one is fine so let's say the heaviest person is 4 or in general case weight of heaviest person is h and the lightest person's weight is l so we will see what is the capacity what is the total weight when we put heavy and low smallest and heaviest both together is it greater than equal to is it greater than limit equal to is allowed then the heaviest one will go alone because if you you, you would want to pair as many people as you can or in this case maximum 2 is allowed so you would like that uh, whenever you are sending a person you pair someone someone with him so that you minimize the number of boats only 2 is allowed so whatever is the heaviest person one choice is that you send him alone second choice is that you pair him with some other person or if you take the lightest person if you can pair the lightest person with heavier one heaviest one then you can pair it with any one so better pair with the heaviest one or if you look at the heaviest person if you you can pair it with the lightest person send him with lightest person and if this is more than limit then definitely if the lightest person cannot pair with the heaviest person then it will not pair with any other person is all the other weights are more than or equal to the lightest person so if this is true that is this lim is more than the limit then heaviest person has to go alone in place of l any weight you replace it will be more than that so in this case if h plus l is more than limit limit is capital l then this will go alone if this is less than equal to limit then heaviest and lightest goes together now you see that this is correct we are not violating any constraint we are sending two people max two people are allowed it's within the limit and we are following that so how, why will this work if we go on so now in this case we are we have two less people so earlier we had n here here we have n minus 1 because we sent the heavier one alone and we are left with so one boat is exhausted and one person is reduced so number of boats is one here so whatever was the number of boats it increases by one and number of person decreases by one in other case we paired heavier and lightest person heaviest and lightest so again the number of boats increases by one and the number of people decreases by two so we have a smaller problem if we sort 
them in some order increasing or decreasing let's say lightest is here heaviest is here then we have a smaller problem in both cases in one case from here to here and this is the case of alone this is together so why will this work why will it give a minimum number of bolts so uh, the, there are two cases case one is that lightest person goes goes with heaviest person that is h plus l is less than equal to limit so if this is the case then the lighter person can be paired with anyone because the lighter lightest person can be paired with heaviest person then it can be paired with any other person because the heaviest is the heaviest so if you replace it with any smaller value than l then h then still it will be smaller than equal to l so uh, it's correct to pair it with heavier one because we are sending a heavier person out so so it's intuitively correct so the lighter person can be paired with any person so we pick the heaviest among them that so we are not losing on anything we are sending them together and max two are allowed so it's not that you can pair more people here so only two are allowed the other case is that so in this case it has to work the other case is that a uh, lighter one cannot be paired with h that is h plus l is more than l so the heaviest person cannot be paired with any other person if the heaviest person cannot be paired with lighter one lightest one it cannot be paired with any other person so in this case heaviest one has to go alone there is no other choice we pick the lightest one and even that cannot fit in this so in this case we will send alone in this case we will send two so we cannot do better than this so this is the optimal solution so what we are doing in this case first we are sorting it this uh, uh, list of weights so this denotes the weight of first person weight of second person weight of third person fourth and fifth so this array and this is the limit so first sort them so in this case it will be 1 1 2 2 4 4 and run our algorithm so initially number of boards will be 0 and each time we increment the board count by 1 so in either case number of boards increases by 1 and if h plus l that is first and last one index will be here one index will be in the end beginning and end if we add these two and this condition is there that h plus l or if this is i and this is j then people i if people i plus people j is more than limit then what we do we send the heaviest one alone there is no other choice so j decrements so let's say i was in the beginning of the sorted list and j was in the end this is the lightest this is the heaviest and board count increases by 1 irrespective of this so let's keep it outside this and else uh, i plus plus j minus minus because we can send them together and still board count increases by 1 and we run this entire loop till i is less than equal to j so let's write the code for this so first i will write in c++ then java and python so uh, let's see the time complexity what is the time complexity here so we are sorting this list so if the list has n number n people then sorting will take n log n time and then we are iterating this uh, list from once i is moving in this direction j is moving in this direction we stop when they cross each other so another n so n log n plus n that is n log n 
and space uh, we are using uh, if we are changing this list itself we are sorting it itself without creating a new list then uh, we are not using any other variables other than some pointers so space is of one now let's uh, complete our code so first step is sorting so in sort we pass the two iterators from where to where sort so we are sorting the entire list so people dot begin and people dot end now this is sorted in ascending order and any order will work for us we will just need to tune our algorithm i is 0 and j is 1 the last index that is size minus 1 boats initially it's 0 If it's more than limit, send the heaviest one alone, no choice. So J decre decreases, else. I plus plus and J minus minus. So J minus minus is common, so better write the different code here. And there is no else required because j minus minus is there in both cases so we have put it outside or you can write if else if it make makes it more clear if it's more than limit j minus minus if it's else i plus plus j minus minus so you see j minus minus is common and then boats also is common This solution is accepted so we did not run through our example i i hope it was clear but let's run through it so in this case we have sorted it so 4 plus 1 is 5 limit is 5 so 4 and 1 go together one board then we have a smaller array this one so i plus plus i is now here j minus minus so j now comes here i moves here smallest plus lightest is 3 which is less than uh, limit so 2 and 1 goes together and i comes here j comes here both here now 2 is less than limit so 2 goes alone so 3 boards are required so in this case the answer should be 3 we don't have to write the exact solution just the count So our C++ solution is accepted. Next we will write in Java and Python which will be very simple. Very similar to this one. Java solution is also accepted. Finally, we will do it in Python.
Python solution is also accepted.